Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, let me show you how to make some ensalada de coditos. Ensalada de coditos is simply just a Puerto Rican style macaroni salad. It is very flavorful and very delicious. And perhaps if you're not a fan of regular macaroni salad, I have no doubt that you will really, really like this one and you will be making it often. So let's get into it. So to start making the macaroni salad, I have boiled about three cups of elbow macaroni pasta per packaging instructions. And after I've strained my pasta water, I'm gonna run some very cold water through my pasta to stop it from cooking. So while I was cooking my pasta, I was also simultaneously boiling four large eggs and I boiled them for 15 minutes. I find that 15 minutes is like the sweet spot. It is the perfect time to boil eggs. You do not want to overboil them because then they turn gray in the inside and they just don't look good. So yeah, so then I just transfer them over into a bowl of ice water and doing this is going to help the eggshells peel off effortlessly. So now that I have both my pasta and my eggs cooked and put to the side, I'm gonna saute some diced cooking ham for about five minutes or so until they're nice and golden. And then after I saute them, I'm gonna remove them from my pan and I'm gonna set them aside to cool for a bit. So now that my boiled eggs from earlier have been sitting in the ice bath for about 10 minutes, it is time to peel my eggs and you're gonna see how easy it is for me to remove the shell. So after I've peeled all of my eggs, I'm simply just going to use the side and the back of my fork and I'm just going to smash them together and to kind of just, just dice them up with my fork instead of using a knife. It's much easier and it's much faster. So now it's finally time to create my macaroni salad and I'm going to start by adding my seasonings. So here I'm adding about one teaspoon of some salt, but as always, this can be adjusted according to your taste. Then I'm gonna add about one quarter of a teaspoon of some ground black pepper. And now I started by adding about one teaspoon of some oregano leaves. And then here I have about two tablespoons of some pimientos. You can also use some fresh red pepper, but I find that the pickled red peppers, the pimientos just adds a nice flavor. And then I'm gonna add about half a cup of some chopped white onion. And now I'm gonna add the ham from earlier. And here I have about half of an orange bell pepper. This is just a bell pepper that I had in my fridge that was gonna go bad and I didn't want it to go to waste, but any pepper, whether you have green, yellow, does not matter. And then I'm gonna add about one teaspoon of some yellow mustard. And no, your pasta salad will not taste like mustard. This is just gonna add a little bit of acidity. And now the boiled eggs from earlier. Then I'm gonna add about one cup of some mayo. And 
then about two tablespoons of some extra virgin olive oil. Lastly, about one teaspoon to two teaspoons of some white vinegar. And after I've added all of my ingredients, I'm gonna give it a nice mix. So now that my macaroni salad has come together, now is the perfect time to check for spice content and salt content. And I checked it and I found that I needed just a little more salt according to my preference. And I also added a little extra oregano because I love oregano and yeah, I like a lot of oregano in my pasta salad. So all in all, I added about one teaspoon and a quarter of a teaspoon of both salt and oregano and remember that all of the ingredients for this recipe are going to be listed in the description box below so if you've enjoyed today's tutorial on how to make ensalada de coditos do not forget to give this video a thumbs up share it with your family and friends and if you haven't already please subscribe because a new video will be out every week until next time